Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So, hope you guys having an amazing day today. As what you can see from the title below, we're going to do an experiment. But before we get started, let's roll out the intro music. of today's experiment is to prove that oxygen, fuels, and heat are needed for combustion. So, I'm going to introduce you guys with the materials and apparatus needed for these activities. Materials and apparatus. First, we need two candles. It can be the tea light candles as what I use in this video or you can just use the normal candle. And then we need a glass jar since we're at home right now so you can replace the glass jar with any glass mug. Okay, next one. We need a lighter to light up the candle. Procedure. Now, I'm gonna guide you with the procedure of doing this experiment. First step, you need to light up two similar candles. Make sure both candles have the similar size. And then the second step, invert a glass jar over one of the lighted candles. The last step, record your observation. Right, so let's discuss on the discussion of these activities. Discussion. So based on the experiment that we did just now, even though we had repeat the experiment for three times, so the candles that cover with the glass jar is the one that goes out first. Okay, why does this happen? First, when you cover the when you cover the candles with the glass jar, the amount of oxygen in the glass jar is limited. Okay, when once the once all the oxygen in the glass jar had been used, there's no more oxygen left inside the glass jar. Therefore, the combustion of the candle stop. Okay, now let's discuss on the function of the candles in this experiment. So the candles, the candles acts as a fuel for the combustion. Without the fuels or the candles, there's no combustion can occur. Even though we provide the oxygen, we provide the heat, but without the fuel, which is the candles, the combustion cannot occur. Next one, let's discuss on the function of this lighter. Okay, as you can see, the lighters will produce heat or fire. So the fire provides heat to light up the candle supported by the presence of the oxygen in the air with the combination of oxygen, heat, and also fuel will support the combustion process. Conclusion As for conclusion, we can conclude that oxygen, fuel, and heat are needed for combustion. Alright, so that's all for today's video. Thanks for watching. Till we meet again in the next video. Bye-bye.